happy Tuesday. Are you paying it forward? Are you doing good things for other people? Random acts of kindness can open up your world. It can bring a jolt of positivity into your life. We usually, all of us, me included, get caught up in our own lives and we forget that people have done great things for us. People have done great things for me out of the kindness of their heart. They didn't have to do it. And I believe, you know, wholly that us as human beings owe it to humanity to serve a purpose. And I really believe that that number one purpose is giving, helping others, doing things for people. I'm not saying you have to give people the shirt off of your back, but I mean, a random act of kindness can go a long way. Really think about that. You know, read up on um, different articles of random acts of kindness ideas, because there's plenty of them out there. And just, you know, I would say that in this video, just focus on, on researching the topic of random acts of kindness, getting ideas of random acts of kindness, because today might not be the day that you're supposed to go out and do something. It may be a year from now, but if you plant that seed in your mind of all oh, these different ideas of random acts of kindness, maybe you'll be somewhere one day and you'll see someone in need, or maybe you'll be in a situation one day where you feel like, okay, this person's going through stuff. I should, you know, reach into my wallet and, you know, help this person out, or maybe I should watch this person's kids for them so them and their partner can have a date night because they have things that they need to sort out. Maybe I can go over and, you know, clean the house for someone, you know, just, you know, as I continue to say, because that's been on my mind lately, we need to be willing to give, give, give. We need to give more and take less. Us as a people, we require each other. We need each other. Even when you think you don't need someone or need people, you do. You need people. And the way that you can express your gratitude, you know, in general, to every, you know, for everyone that has helped you and everyone that continues to help you and will continue to help you is to do it yourself. Give of your time, give of your heart, give of your pocket if that's what you feel like you want to do. But as I said before, you know, again, read up on the topic, you know, um, um, flood your mind with giving ideas flood your mind with ways that you can volunteer to help kids, to help people. There's, I'm from a hard neighborhood. There are tons of kids. This is why I teach martial arts for free and why, you know, and why my coach taught me and, and gave me a, a, a vast amount of knowledge as a young man, a, a great deal of uh, time and, 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 and energy because you know where I'm from there's a lot of kids that are in need there's a lot of kids with you know just like other places I'm not saying that my my hometown is the only place like that but you know single uh, father household single mother household L low money you know can't afford extracurricular activities there's a ton of things that you can do okay you know I got friends galore who coach sports for free you know, uh, work at the boys and club, boys and girls club. You know, uh, volunteering for free. There's a ton of things you can do to pay it for, folks. You know, be a good person, be a human being, be someone that can inject happiness into other people's lives. Happy Tuesday.